everybody, this is Kim from Dorothy's Daughter. Welcome to my channel. I am still coming to you from San Antonio at my brother's home. But I want to take you on a tour of all the Love Notions tops. And remember, I do have a code that you can use for an extra 10% off. It happens to be during the 40% off sale as I record this. The code is all the time. So um, the code right now is cover stitch, but stay in touch with our Facebook group because it does change every quarter. All right, I want you to buckle up because I have lots of patterns to talk about. All of the top patterns that Love Notion offers. So if you're ready, I will uh, put the line drawing up. And if I have some photographs of my makes, I will also throw those up, okay? All right, buckle up, here we go. First up is the Canyon Cardigan. That comes in sizes extra small to triple X, and it has three styles, an A-line, gathered, and waterfall. I have made this cardigan a couple times. I love it. Um, it is really great in a flowy knit, although I made it in a French terry and it came out really, really nice. So I think that you can't go wrong with this pattern and um, it's one of a few cardigans that I'm going to talk about today. Next up is the Rhapsody. The Rhapsody dress and top is a wonderful pattern that is, uh, I think of it as summery, although you can wear it in the fall and winter. It does have long sleeve versions. It actually, in fact, has nine sleeve variations. Um, it comes in sizes extra small to 5X and um, it comes in both blouse and dress lengths. Full bust option is included and as usual, it is a wonderful pattern with a great fit from Love Notions. All right, the Melody Dolman. One of my favorite shirts that I own is my Melody Dolman Beetle shirt that I made and did a video about a couple years ago. I love this top. It is a camp shirt type thing. You can either tie it at the waist or you can wear it um, just as a shirt tail. It is a fantastic shirt. It makes up in many different fabric choices. I used a quilting fabric when I made mine, um, but you could make it in a silkier fabric if you want to dress it up. You could also wear it open and it would be a kimono style. Um, really, really cool pattern. Um, definitely can open up your creativity. It comes in sizes extra small to triple XL with a full bust option. It is for woven fabrics only. All right, next is the Presto tunic. I love this tunic. I have made a long sleeve version in a chiffon fabric, which I just adore. It is, comes extra small to triple XL. Four sleeve options. You have sleeveless, three quarter, short, and long. Great pattern. I did a video a few years ago, uh, a collab with Karina from Lifting Pins and Needles, and uh, we both decided that we really, really enjoyed this shirt. I plan to make some sleeveless ones this summer because I really like this pattern. Next, we have the Laundry Day Tee, which of course is the free pattern that you can get when you join the Love Notions Facebook group, so definitely do that. It is a swing dress. It has a beautiful line. It's easy, uh, cool, and comfortable. Comes in sizes extra small to 5X, three hem lengths, tunic, shirt, and knee length dress. It has an option for a high-low hem as well. It has three necklines. You can do a scoop, a V, or a uh, shawl collar. And it's just a must-have in your arsenal of patterns. Next up is the Lotus blossom blouse for ladies. Lady size is extra small to 3XL. It is a very flattering design with a little twist right at the bottom hemline. Really cute. The, the twist is subtle unlike some where it's a huge big knot. This is more of a subtle, uh, I like it in a flowy fabric. Um, you can make it in a little bit thicker fabric if you want that 
tie or twist to be a little bit more pronounced. Wonderful pattern. I have made that only once and I have not taken any photos of it. Uh, it was prior to doing this channel, so I didn't photograph it. The Vivace Dolman is next. It comes in extra small to 5X. This is a great uh, top and dress. It comes in three lengths, uh, top, tunic, and dress. It comes extra small to 5X, it has a dolman sleeve. There is a full bust option included in the pattern. Next up is Summer Basics. And if you watched my top 10, then you know that Summer Basics is one of those patterns that I chose for my top 10. It is a knee length dress, maxi dress, which is my favorite, or a top length tank really great it has wonderful lines where you can lengthen that torso just a little bit if you have a long waist as I do um, it comes extra small to 5x um, there is a shelf bra option included in this pattern if you so desire and there's a full bust option as well the serenity sweater is next lady sizes extra small to 5x there are four sleeve options. You have long, short, sleeveless, and three-quarter. The Serenity is drapey, beautiful, and uh, flowy. It looks really nice with a sweater knit, like a lightweight sweater knit in the fall. But you could also make it sleeveless and wear it, uh, make it out of a really, uh, like a stretch chiffon, or some kind of a lightweight knit in the summertime would be very cute, especially sleeveless. All right, this is not a top, but I threw it in here because there are options. It is the composed robe, which you could make as a kimono. So I kind of threw it in there with the jackets. It is lady sizes, extra small to 5X. It also is available in kid sizes. So definitely keep that in mind for the little ones. A few years ago, I made uh, composed robes for my entire six grandkids and my mother-in-law so i've made a lot of these um, it is lady sizes extra small to 5x as i said full bust option two lengths um, knee and calf length you can um, use knits or wovens with this pattern which is very cool um, and it is a great staple to have in your arsenal next is the whistler the whistler sweater and hoodie the whistler is a really unique pattern. It is sort of a bigger flowy top. It has a shawl collar or a hoodie option. You have lady sizes extra small to 5x. You can use a banded bottom or you can leave it to straight hem. Um, you can get creative with buttons on that placket. I really enjoy the Whistler pattern. Um, I made a black double brush poly one that I just adore and it is a fantastic pattern to have in your arsenal. I will tell you that the first time I saw the Whistler, it was not necessarily one that I would have sought after. But once I made it, I love this pattern. So don't overlook it because it's really a great pattern. Next is another cardigan, the Boyfriend Cardigan. Comes in ladies sizes, extra small to 5X. It has a little shawl collar, or it could just be a straight placket or a hood. Um, it has drop patch pockets, which kind of are slouchy, but really popular nowadays. It is an open front, two lengths, mid thigh and duster length. Um, I love the length of this cardigan. As a short person, the duster length is just right for a mid-thigh version for me. Next up, the Lyric Dress and Peplum. I think of this more as a dress, but it indeed is a peplum as well. Comes in sizes 0 to 32. Uh, there also is a kids version called the Dolce. So if you wanted to uh, make mommy and me outfits, you could definitely do that. Um, it comes peplum, knee, and mid-calf length. It has a flared or gathered peplum slash skirt. It has five different sleeve options. It has a long gathered sleeve. It has a uh, flounce sleeve. It has sleeveless, a uh, fluttery cap sleeve, and also a short sleeve. Next up is the Arlington sweater. 
The Arlington is a turtleneck or mock neck, and it has a wonderful, it lays just beautifully. It comes in sizes extra small to 5X. I love the dress version of this. Uh, I wear this dress that I'm showing you here a lot. Um, it's great for under jackets in the winter time. Um, you could even wear it in the transitional time in a short sleeve mock neck. Um, it's a really nice looking top. It is not completely straight, but it is not real fitted either. It has just a slight, takes the line of your body just slightly. It's really great pattern. Next up is the Harmony blouse. The Harmony is a swing top for woven fabrics. Really a great, uh, very, very quick pattern to make. It uses bias binding for the neckline and if you do sleeveless it also uses it for the sleeves. The hemline um, dips a little in the back which I really like, coverage over my bottom. It has uh, four sleeve options, short, half flutter or sleeveless which uh, I think is really great. If you watch my top 10, then you will know where this falls for me. This is the Metra Blazer. The Metra Blazer is a timeless pattern. It's a jacket. Um, it has a wide lapel or a shawl collar, has welt pockets in the seam line in the front. Um, nice roomy pockets, fits your phone or anything else that you might need, especially like on a Sunday morning when you've got people in church and you've got things you have to carry with you. It is a wonderful pattern. Um, it is for knits. I have made them in a ponte. I have made them in a French terry. You can dress this up or dress it down. It, it's just as at home as a little jacket to throw on because it's a little chilly with jeans as it is to wear as a suit to an event. The Breckenridge Henley. I love the Henley look. Um, this comes as a top or a dress. You can do a cuffed sleeve, three quarters, a long cuff or a short sleeve with this pattern. It comes extra small to 5X. Uh, you can do shirt, tunic, and dress lengths. There also is a full bust option for this pattern. Next up is the Forte top and dress. So this is many patterns in one. So the tops include a dropped waist ruffle or a flouncy, um, an umpire waisted flared look. So it has sleeve options of short, bishop, um, ruffled, all kinds of different options there. So uh, also, you can also do a flutter short sleeve really cute. I've made several of these. I love them. I sort of prefer the um, either the straight with just the flutter sleeve or else the ruffled dropped waist. Um, I'm not as crazy about the empire waist just because it doesn't really um, suit my figure that well, but it looks great on taller people. <laughs> All right, next up, Margot Peplum. Margot comes in extra small to 5X. It's a great peplum that you can wear, uh, dress it up, dress it down. Um, you can also do a dress. It has a full bust option. You can do two different bodice styles. You can do a princess line or just a straight line. You can do either swing, gathered, or pleated peplums on there. So it's wonderful. And you can also do a peplum or a dress. So definitely go for the Margot peplum. Next up, the ballad. Um, I love the ballad. Don't be scared of the shirring. It's very easy to do. Um, but it does have an option where you don't have to do the shirring if you don't want to. You can just do a gather. It has gathering at the back and it has a placket front with buttons. It's really cute. It's a little bit similar to the Rhapsody, but has its own character definitely has a full bust option. There are five sleeves available. Sleeveless, puff, flutter, bishop, short sleeve, and with a cuff. The Lincoln Top. The Lincoln Top is really cute. It has um, 
side lines with buttons here. It looks really cute to leave the last one unbuttoned so it becomes like a side split. It comes extra small to 5X. It has a drop shoulder. There is a full bust option and it is for knits. The Rockford Raglan. I love the Rockford. It is a basic raglan pattern. You can watch one of my videos where I turned it into a halter type neckline in a sleeveless halter type uh, tunic. It's really cute. Um, extra small to 5X for body views. It has just the shirt. It also has this overlay with a point. Very stylish. Sleeve lengths are three quarter long and short. Um, two lengths, you can do a short shirt or a tunic. The Salt Whistle. The Salt Whistle is the baby of Kira, um, a fellow ambassador on Love Notions. It's beautiful. It has that island vibe, just like she does. Um, it is, as a top, it has a peplum. You can also do it as a dress that has tiers of scallops. Just beautiful. Um, it's for woven fabrics. It has a square neckline, which is spaced, which, you know, it's it just lays beautifully. It's meant for woven fabrics. Really super cute. The Aria is your basic classic button-down shirt. Comes extra small to 5X. You can do a shirt dress, a shirt, or a longer tunic type length. You can do short, long, or sleeveless in the sleeve options. It has side vents also. Super cute and a very nice shirt dress for summer, I might add. Next up, we have the game day jersey. I spent a lot of time talking about this um, in a couple different videos I've done, plus the top 10 this week. I also talked about the game day. It has the look and feel of a sports jersey you can get your cricket and make it a jersey for your favorite football team if you like um, or you can just make it with um, color blocking or however you like it comes extra small to 5x there is a full bust option there's a split hem short sleeve and three quarter length sleeves so i really enjoy the game day one of my favorites classic tee is my most made pattern from Love Notions. I love it. It comes extra small to 5X. It is semi-relaxed fit, so it kind of follows your body, but it does not cling. Three necklines, crew, scoop, and V-neck. And I think I mentioned on my top 10 video that you can actually raise up the scoop if you uh, need a little bit of modesty. It works for me. Uh, full bust pieces are included and it's something everyone needs in their wardrobe. It also has a regular price that's lower than the other patterns on the website. Cadence dress and top. I love Cadence. It's a basic um, it's a basic woven top. In my experience the neckline is large enough to just pull over your head. However, if you want to you can do the hook and eye at the back. It has a back seam, which is great for fit. Comes in extra small to 5X. There are three length options, shirt, skirt, length, and maxi. I have made all three. There are five sleeve options, short, tank, three quarter, flare, and bishop sleeves. So a lot of options there. And definitely meant for woven fabrics. The Terra Tunic is a very versatile pattern. It is a tunic that has many different necklines. You can do a hood, you can do a scoop neck, a v-neck, a, a cowl neck, there's a split neck which is really attractive, and also a boat neck. Comes in extra small to 5x. There is a full bust option and there are four sleeve lengths. So definitely check out the Terra tunic another basic you need in your wardrobe. The Oakley vest is really cute in the fall when you just need a little bit of coverage. Size is extra small to 5X. There are three views and three pocket options. Uh, 
There's a, also a full bust option as well. There's a hood option or in a curved hem. Really cute and timeless. It will never go out of style. Next up is the title top and dress. This is a basic princess line swing dress. There are three length options. There's top, knee length dress, and maxi dress. It's a very quick sew, very, very quick sew. It comes extra small to 5X, and I know you would enjoy this dress. The tab at the top is kind of a unique one, not one people talk about a lot, but super cute. It is lady sizes extra small to 3XL, semi-fitted top with five sleeve lengths. It has sleeveless, uh, three quarters, short and long. You have yoke detail that you can add to that as well. You can do a scoop neck or a bateau neck. Very, very cute pattern. You can do this shirt tail um, sort of feature on there as well. And it's just a really cute top. The La Bella Donna is another one of those staples that you need in your wardrobe. Comes in extra small to 5X. It's a dolman style uh, tee, basically. Um, it's a tiny bit more of an oversized, but um, it's really, it's a really nice fit. You can do a hood if you like. You can do a shawl collar if you like. Uh, shirt and tunic lengths and a full bust option. Next is the Willow Wrap Top, which I have made um, be prior to starting my channel, and I don't have a photo to show you, but I love this top. It comes extra small to double XL. There are two different necklines. It's a wrap type. Um, there is an option for an asymmetrical hemline, which is what I did, and it is a very nice pattern that has some shirring on the side when you do that. Um, asymmetrical hemline that I really like a lot. Sloan sweater is another, this is your basic sweatshirt. You can do a hoodie, you can do um, a color blocked sweatshirt, you can, there's a lot of options with Sloan. It comes extra small to 5X. You have elbow patches included in the pattern if you are interested in that. Next up is the trendy tunic. The trendy tunic is a the trendy tunic is a basic princess sort of line with pockets that sort of take the shape. The pockets kind of make the shape with this one. It's extra small to double XL. The knit tunic top with modern styling, obviously three sleeve options, short, three quarter, and long. And that is our quick tour of the Love Notions tops that are available. There is also the Lennox, which is just going to be released this week, so be watching for that one as well. And as always, use my code for 10% off. At the moment, it is Cover Stitch, all capital. If you are watching this uh, anytime after the second quarter of 2023, it will have changed. So check the Facebook group where I always keep a post tagged under the featured posts and with the current code. All right, have a fantastic day. I hope this sale has been a wonderful thing for you, you guys. <clears throat> I hope you have been able to fulfill all your wish lists uh, for Love Notions this week. Have a fantastic day. I will be home next week sometime and um, back at my sewing machine, but until then, I will see you in the next video. Happy sewing!